I'm Natalia Bonner. Welcome back. I'm so excited to share this fun little sneak peek, a little bit of my machine quilting. So this is an awesome quilt that my client Desta did all of this incredible hand applique. Now this quilt has the most amazing story behind it. I love it. I love that about quilts. I love that about machine quilting is every quilt really does have a story. So today I'm going to share just a little sneak peek, a little bit of the machine quilting that I'm doing on this incredible quilt. If you do want to see more of this quilt, if you want to take a deeper dive into my machine quilting with me, kind of see my whole process, why I quilt the things that I do, where I do, hop over to Patreon. It's a great place to dive deeper into machine quilting with me. So today I'll share just a sneak peek. Before we hop over to the machine though, I do want to tell you a few of the products. I do all of my quilting on a Gamel 22 inch machine. This is hand guided quilting and I will be working with my mini four in one machine quilting ruler. The thread that I'm using here today on the top, I'm using so fine. I'm going to actually use a couple of different colors. And then on my bobbin, I'm using bottom line thread. So you can pick up all of these products that I've mentioned, plus join my online classes, stitch alongs, all the other fun stuff that I'm doing over on our website, peaceandquilt.com. Let's get stitching. So here's just a fun sneak peek at some of this fabulous machine quilting on this incredible quilt. Now, if you do want to see a more in-depth process of how I machine quilted this entire quilt, kind of more of a step-by-step -step behind the scenes, a bit of marking, and even my thought process as to why I quilt the designs I quilt and where, he head on over to my Patreon page, patreon.com slash Natalia Bonner. That's where I go more in depth into the videos and share all the yummy details. So these images are a little bit of the machine quilting after the quilt is all complete. I think here you can see just a bit of the different designs and spaces, different elements that I use throughout this quilt. So this is definitely a lot of ruler work, a lot of marking, and a lot of free motion quilting. Most of the designs that I do share here on this quilt, I also teach in my book and online class, Beginner's Guide to Free Motion Quilting. If you haven't checked that one out, make sure you do. Also, if you're looking for a little bit of extra help on your ruler work, check out my book, Visual Guide to Creative Straight Line Quilting. With a design like this, you can see that I have gone through using the blue Mark Be Gone marker and done quite a bit of my marking before I begin any of my machine quilting. When I do my machine quilting, I like to work in small sections. Like you can see here, because I have marked out these sections, then I'm going to work as I go. So working back and forth between a little bit of ruler work and a bit of free motion quilting. Now this quilt, I really, really wanted my applique or my client's applique to really pop. So I am using one layer of the Quilter's Dream wool batting. The texture that I'm able to create with that batting is, like you can see, it's awesome. It's a fabulous batting. Now throughout this quilt, I am also using a couple of different thread colors. So here you can see I'm using a really light, nice blue thread. When I work on that outside border though, I am going to change and use a darker blue thread that blends a little bit better with that section on my whole entire quilt backing. This quilt has a fabulous backing. It's a mostly white with a little bit of blue in it, but because of that, I'm going to use just one color of thread on my entire quilt backing, just a nice off-white bottom line thread. The thread that I'm using on the top is so fine. So I'll give you just a few minutes to watch as I do a bit of the quilting here. Like I said, if you do want more inspiration, if you want to see more of this fabulous quilt, do hop over to my Patreon page. Have a great day, everybody.